Dear Jen, it's 6.44 p.m. October 30th. What hustle are they pulling where they silence the telepathy? I have no fucking clue what's going on. So what hustle are they pulling? That's their favorite technique. They silence telepathy. I'm oblivious. That's their tactic. If you haven't figured it out yet. Analytical skills of two-year-olds, psychiatric illness, or zero credibility and you're involved with the terrorist and involved with the theft. One. Two. These people do not have satellite operators licenses. Why aren't they in prison? Three. They do not have medical licenses to be interacting with the human nervous system. They do not have the right to be doing neuromodulation or any form of neurosurgery. They do not have medical licenses. It is illegal. Not to mention, these aren't, they're not even performing science. They are weaponizing this technology. They're using this technology as a technology, as a, they're using this medical technology or science technology to, as a weapon. They're weaponizing. They're using it to defeat a, an opponent. Make an opponent bend the knee, hence it's a weapon. It is not a medical tool or a science tool. So they are committing aggravated assault and robbery with a deadly weapon. Another key crime. They are committing sexual violence. They do not have informed consent. They do not have consent to do surgeries. I was never psychotic. They committed political abuses of psychiatry in 2018 and lied about the implantation and lied about the devices they were putting in my brain and peripheral nervous system, my heart, my lungs, my genitals. Why are these people not in prison? And they're using slander with malice to coerce crime. So why aren't these terrorists in prison where they belong? And uh, why aren't they being tried for human rights and civil rights violations? They're committing psychological torture, severe mental distress through repeated threats of harm, repeated harm, repeated assault, which is 20 years. They are also performing witness tampering in a, in a case involving RICO, terrorism, and economic espionage. Another 20 years. That's 40 years. They're also committing IP theft, data theft, and economic espionage. They're also committing felony hacking crimes. They're also committing felony impersonation. They're also performing illegal gambling, and they're involved in RICO. When are they all going to prison? It's illegal gambling, blackmail, bribery, extortion, betting manipulation, witness tampering, obstruction of justice, tax evasion. When are they going to prison? And when are they getting their assets freezed and seized? What is this nonsense?